Alright, so what we've got today, we've got another blast from the past and we've got a classic today. We're playing uh, Final Fight, but not for the Super Famicom, unfortunately today. We're playing the arcade version um, on the PS4 Pro via Capcom uh, Arcade Collection, something like that. But yeah, it's a, it's a good collection actually, it's uh, really arcade perfect, uh, I love it. Um, yeah, we're going to see what it's like. Uh, really do remember this from back in the day. Uh, like I said, I had a Super Famicom. I think back it. I think I got it back in 1990. Not that one. Not that one there. But I had it back in the day. Just mess around with these. Uh, let's get the correct screen. Ah, that looks good. I like that. I like the curved. It looks proper like a arcade cabinet. Hang on. I like the curved screen. It's also on the. Uh, I've, I've got it twice on PlayStation 4 Pro on, on two collections. I've got it under this. Uh, it's like this big Capcom arcade collection, and there's also one called Capcom Beat 'em Up collection as well. I've also got it under that. So, but I, I prefer it under this because it's got more screen options. So yeah, it's got like a lot. Looks looks more authentic. Yeah, I like that. So yeah, as you say, this is, it came out in 1989 uh, in the arcades. So I would have been about 17. Then. Okay. And uh, I know on the Super Famicom, it, it's only got two characters. I don't think it has this one guy. I know there was a separate release with guy in it. So. But I didn't buy that one, I just had the normal suit. I mean, at the time, I thought it was arcade perfect. Look, looked arcade perfect to me when I'm playing it. But I think this guy's the. Uh, I think he's the weakest one out of these three. Uh, I think he's the fastest, but uh, I find um, he's the weakest. But yeah, we're going to give this a playthrough, see how, how we go. I've got it set to the easiest level. Because. <laughs> uh, I know it is a pretty tough game to uh, one credit, if it's ever possible to one credit, especially on a harder level. Uh, the reason these car games was uh, made for eating up your pennies or ten peas back in the day, or quarters if you're in America. I don't know what you used to, how much they used to cost in America for a day. I, I know in the UK. You, you can if you're lucky, you could find a machine which was uh, 10p ago. Uh, a lot of them was uh, 20, 20p. I know, I remember back in the day. But I used to search around for ones which was uh, 10p so you just could get more games. Yeah, I really, really chuffed when it came out for the Super Nintendo. It's like Sarah, it, it, it is how I remembered it from the arcade as well, so it was a really great conversion. And I played it to death when I was super fun of when I got it. Now, I think it came out in Japan first, so but I didn't import uh, Super Nintendo anyway. It's the Super Fun of Kong, so I pretty much got it on import straight away. So we should get this first guy out of the way. First boss. I don't know how he get how he dodges jumps. We're so gonna sit on the wall, whistle his mates. He comes in and jumps at me like that. It's been a long time, so we just continue it, shall we? When we uh, don't know how many continues I'll need. Probably about 20. Even though I have got on the uh, easiest level. Never grows old. So I love this game. No, it never grows old. Always like uh, come back and have a quick go on it every now and again. Every other year. I did also um, a few years later. I was called got a game called Burning Fight, which is a which is a rip off of this Neo Geo's version. And it, I, I was actually I did actually I, I like that one as well. 
I think because I was really into the, I got after the Super Nintendo, the Super Famicom, I got into the Neo Geo, and uh, I don't think the gameplay was as good. And the backdrops, the levels, the levels weren't as good, but uh, the graphics are held up. Sent is one of the early uh, Neo Geo games, and uh, it had good sound on it as well. But yeah, they had to come out with it. I think, I think for right on the Neo Geo Burning Fire, I think there was only two. Oh god, two characters as well. So oh, these could be a pain in the ass. Andre the Giant. Well, watch out for you right up. Got the screen. I'm on the uh, subway. Yeah, I used to like back in the day the uh, the way the handrails used to wobble, the details like that, and the, the backdrops going through the uh, train, like going through the station. Oh. Oh. I, thought I, gonna, I thought it was going to finish then. It was the uh, it was the middle button. <laughs> I kept pressing start to start the game. I might have to insert points for like R three. Now I shouldn't be doing that. Oh, I like what I like like this version as well. The uh, this collection rather than the uh, Capcom beat em up. You've, you've also got a uh, fast forward, rewind, and like I say, with extra screen um, display screens as well. So, if you wanted that authentic look, you can do. I know you've got scan lines on the other version, so I do actually like this one. I just need to put my arcade stick here, I'm still playing with the old. Uh, just for that more authentic feel. Go on, Andre, get down. The life gone. I'm not counting the life. It's also got an auto fire on it, but help, which makes it a little easier, a tad easier. You want to save your buttons. Say auto fire, auto punch. I like them swords. Probably is when you just sat above two two weapons they, they'll just duck and can be a can be a nuisance yeah I think I got this back in the day on Super Famicom 1990 1991 can't remember now I know what I thought was the Really great arcade conversion. There were various ports on it. I think there was one on the Sega CD. Was the one on PC Engine as well? Turbo Graphics. Somebody left to put uh, that in the comments. I don't think there was. Maybe I'm just getting mixed up with Street Fighter. Maybe if there was one on there. I know there was a Sega, was it Sega Saturn or Sega CD? I don't know. There's another life gone. Hey there. Try hey there. I think there was uh, some on various collections, but. Uh, I 
don't know whether it came out on Sega Saturn on the uh, PlayStation on the Sega uh, Capcom Generations, maybe. I don't know, I can't remember. Maybe it came one of them. Alright. Apart from that, I think it came on Xbox 360. Xbox Live Gold. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to look at Wikipedia, I think. But yeah, it got a lot of uh, conversion. And this, so there's, so there's plenty of ways to play it. So oh, no excuse. If you want to go back and try it out, if you've got PlayStation or Xbox, yeah, you can either play it via the Capcom beat em up collection or or this collection arcade collection I think they're only a couple of quid each if you don't want to buy the old one how do you smash his old car up? doesn't seem to be no it's not smashing anymore up, is it I want him to say oh my car no failed I also think I can't remember rightly maybe somebody can uh, put in the comments I'm not sure if there was a level missing on the Super Famicom one Super Nintendo one either if I recall I think there was I don't think it had all the levels on it I don't think there was two players on either so that's the only difference Maybe I'm wrong about the levels, but uh, maybe I'm thinking of another game, but uh, I'm pretty sure, if I recall, it didn't have, it, it had a level missing as well. But apart from that, it was pretty much, unless you've gone side by side, it, was, it felt pretty much arcade perfect. It was good for back in the day anyway. <laughs> Oh, nice little head butt to his belly. Ah, so we've done his little bum stomp by uh, doing super move. Do we need a chicken yet? No, we'll wait. Might need it in a bit. Save that. Something else. About to go down. Shit! Quick, get the chicken. Ah! Oh, <laughs> I needed that chicken. It gave me full health, eh? And the good thing about this is, well, you can put as many credits in it as you want. I think back in the day, on the arcades, back in 1990, I only had a pound at a time. I had to go and scrounge a pound off my dad. Whilst he was in the, uh, the pub. Dad, I want a pound for the arcade. I mean, this was talking back in Great Yarmouth where we used to go. And uh, I think we used to go... There was an arcade on Wellington Pier, but I don't think we had Final Fight. I think I had to go either in the... It was either the Mint or the Flamingo. So if anyone knows of that, uh, knows what I'm talking about, you know, <laughs> leave us a like. <laughs> Good days. In fact, we're taking his dogs to the armor for a few weeks' time, so I might take him uh, go in there for a long weekend. So I'm going to check out the arcade. I don't think they were what they used to be, but uh, I might pop in one or two. I'm pretty sure the mint and the flamingo is still there, so just for the nostalgia sake, I might just. Tag team. I, I don't want to be in the middle. I want to get one of these for the bath, both on the outside. That's it. Hopefully. Oh, oh. stop with your bum stomp. It's easier if you've got them like. Okay. What's that one? To the club now. I've just come out the club. 
<laughs> Just come out the club. Down the uh, green streets. Yeah, so that's what I'm going to do when I get to Yarmouth in a few weeks' time. Uh, yeah, I'm just going for a long weekend to somewhere to take his dogs. Be yeah, you got Hagar again. Hagar, Hagar. I think it's Hagar, isn't it? He was in a few spin off games as well, weren't he? I think he's been in a few Street Fighter games. Cody has as well. I suspect guys been in a few, but Cody, I, I named my first dog after Cody. Um, German Shepherd. That was like. Uh, bought, that, bought that German Shepherd in the year 2000. He was with us for 15 years, so... And there's a little bit of trivia for you. The final fight. Or Street Fighter. Link. This guy's better than talking. I'll have to look on YouTube, see if anyone's ever won really credited this. Especially on a hard level. <laughs> I find it quite difficult. You, I think it, the game's made so you do actually uh, have to rip. Especially the arcade. So you actually put money in. So I find it quite difficult. Find if somebody's actually one credit with this on a harder level. Well, I'd be impressed that uh, somebody has. Oh, look, I've got a. I don't know if that showed up, but I've got, a, I've got an achievement then. Or trophy, I should say. Continue. If somebody has one credit with this, they've, they've got too much time on their hands, that's what I say. Another level done, I'm going to the industrial area. Oh, I hate this one. Just the floors. I know there's a there's probably a pattern. But it's like here, you've got enemies and you've got all the floor. So you basically you've got to go all the way to the right somehow. Where you've got no where the floor isn't on fire. I think here you've got to be on that bit on the right whilst enemies appear. <laughs> so yeah, it'll be uh, I'm gonna have to check YouTube in a bit I think and uh, a bit later see if anyone has ever one CC'd this game. It'd be hard to one CC on the easiest level even. I mean, I'm on the easiest level now, and I'm like... I've died a few times. I've had to continue, like... I'm on about fifth continue, man. It would have been better if them barrels, if you hit them, they... I hate these. These guys remind me, I don't know if you've watched a film called Roadhouse back in the 80s. There was a fat bouncer on that. <laughs> these guys, but with no hair, obviously. Don't know why, but these guys always like, remind, them fat dudes remind me of uh, him. I don't know, maybe they're actually modelled off of him. <laughs> like Andre the Giant there. That character's now modelled off the wrestler into Andre the Giant, so but it's called Andor. Let 
with a life gun. Continue. That's another 20p. Well, I'm on about £2 now, aren't I? Although in the arcade, it wouldn't be set to the easiest. It would probably be set to the hardest level. <laughs> Just so you last about... You'll probably get the first level done with a couple of credits. And yeah, that's it. You'll probably last about... A minute, if that, then you're just whacking in them quarters or them tens or twenty p's. Yeah, I think I'm on about two pounds now. I've spent on this. If I was in the arcade, it was set to the easiest level. See what I mean? Right here, how can somebody want credit this? You've got grenades popping down. You've got the lifts full of characters behind you, in front of you. If somebody's one credited this, then they've spent hundreds and hundreds of hours playing this one game. Mastering it. So that's why I could never one credit a game, because uh, I've just got to I've got I've got too many games to play. Could never have the time to just play a master. So yeah. Keep the coder. I've never got the time to master one game. Even though there's a lot of games I like to play, a lot of uh, retro games, shoot 'em ups, especially shoot 'em ups, I play a lot of shoot 'em ups. There's never one game I could like just stay on to master. I know back in the day when I had a Saturn, I, I really wanted to master some games or I think uh, when I was on the uh, I'd shoot them up and I thought right, I really want to complete this game on one credit. Not one life, even just one credit would be uh... but I never got that. I never got there. I never got there. Yeah, see you later. I don't know who that is, it's my neighbour shouting. What's my favourite level? Ooh, I think the sub level I reckon, that's my favourite level. Uh, you go on the subway and the train, the backdrops. Uh, yeah, what's your favourite level? What if you've played this game before? Yeah, what, what, what level do you find more pleasing? Do you enjoy? I mean, I enjoy the game on the whole. I mean, it's not something I could play for hours and hours on end, it's something where you just want to go on for that a bit of an established kick and a bit of a, a bit of arcade gameplay and you know, a bit of a glitch on there right? I like this sword, if you can keep them at a distance I'll oh, pooch there look alright here we go look in from uh, Roadhouse and his brother and his other twin. Shit, I wanted to chuck him the other way then. Bill Bull. Are they all called Bill Bulls? No, Wong. Wong. Did you say WBA? Barrel? I don't need chicken, but take it for the points. Andor, I've got Andor Junior. Which one's Junior? Is that the one? Yeah, he's the one in the red, isn't he? 
dog. Oh, I need that chicken. No, I can't get it. It's just off screen. <laughs> oh, I've just got it. It's just gone off screen. Never mind. Never mind. Get him. I'll drive him. Should have jumped over there. I think even if you memorised it. I just can't see anybody one credit in this. It's a game like not ghouls and ghosts hard, but it's hard if you're going to one credit. Oh, another life gone. I don't know how many pounds that's gone now. It must be about, must be up to about three quid, four quid now. I've spent in the arcade. In the arcade. Suplex in a girl. And again. I think Hagar is a better character, the best character. Gonna pick the best. If you're gonna pick the easiest character, hey guys, the easiest. I think. Guy's the fastest, and uh, Cody's like the uh, like the middle middle of the uh, middle of the, oh, middle of the row. We got chicken. Quick, put that up. Ganged upon. Oh. Jackson, or is it? Uh... These are a pain in the butt as well. You, just took your fire, fire bombs. Yeah, is that a uh, that character? Is it Michael Jackson, or is it uh, him? Or is it him off fist of the North Star? I can't decide. Okay, what character name? Is it Ken? for a one-handed. Too many knife dudes. All the stabbies. These, these guys jump at you, they slide you. Like that. Another one comes on as well.
So do any of you guys, when you play like, these kind of games, do you play with uh, like I do? Play with any CRT filters on? I mean, I tend to tend to like scan lines. If, if you're done well, if you're done like, if they look authentic, then I prefer to have scan lines on. But some do look a bit too heavy and fake, if you know what I mean. But if it looks like a proper old CRT TV, then I do it. I do it. It looks a bit more crisper, if you ask me. But uh, I know a lot of people don't like them. Whether that's because. Uh, a lot of people today didn't really grow up with proper old box CRT TVs and play video games back back in the day. It's just the way I prefer them. It just seem it's like I say if you've done if you've done is this Abigail. Why's he got a girl's name? Anyway, yeah, if you've done well, I do I do prefer I do prefer scan right behave are we? Shall we? Yeah. He can be a bit of a toughie, can't he? He just chucks you in the air like a little baby. Ooh, diggy. Maybe he thinks you are a baby. Got a red mist on it. Yeah. But yeah, I, I, I prefer them. If they look done well, they're not too in your face, not too ever. And especially, I, I like this curve. If the if the um, if the collection or the emulators, what's running it, gives this sort of curve screen look. It, it just looks like an old style TV. It gives you that proper authentic look. How it would have looked. And it kind of breaks up the pixels as well as well. If you put a few uh, scan lines on. But some people don't like them. Whether that's because they're not used to them or they never used to play them with, you know, they've only played them on computer emulators and never really. It's all a preference, really, isn't it? I mean, either you do or you don't. But, uh, yeah, I do, I do, I do like I do prefer them. But only if they're done well. I mean, if there's some. If some scan lines are too dark and too thick, then they just look too fake. And... But that's how I like to play my uh, retro games. I'm an old teller. Far off now. This is this is the last level, isn't it? So I'll get to his tower. And we'll look in here. That's it. Oh yeah, there's a chandelier. Yeah, we're getting there. Oh. Well, I can't quit now, can we? We're nearly there, man. The, uh, I think I think the uh, I said this it's got a fast forward and slow motion I've just banged the button against my knee and uh, put it into fast fast forward forgot what the button was to get to uh, normal speed so yeah the triggers like fast forward it and slow it down and put it into the enemies and then should go in the lift. Let's get rid of Andor again. Oh, give me a right up or a slap. Just give me a right slap, didn't it? His hand's bigger than my head. There we go. Let's go in the lift. We're nearly there. Going up to the top floor now. Penthouse suite. Here we go. Let's 
the bag. Always, always send the lift down, it's always polite, isn't it? Bill Bull! Wong Boo? What's he want name? I can't see. J rocks it. What is it? Lads, free! Thing is, if you move up and down, you sort of like get. Oh, then he comes and slaps you. With a. It's not a suplex, is it? What's it called? It's called a. I said it earlier. Pile driver, that's it. It's good that it ain't one of them games where you have uh, just one life on the last level. I don't know why they do that. They give you ult unlimited lives some games do, don't they? Then they're like, it's the last, it's the hardest level. We're only going to give you one life for this. Oh, thanks for that. Bum stumped me then, did you? The leather jacket again. I need that. Uh, I need that piece of meat on the floor. Not. not uh, oh, I didn't get it. I didn't get the meat. That piece of meat on the floor. I mean, to health. Oh, look at all these. Yeah, uh, one got made. Yeah, we're there. Not not. Oh. Right, we're inside, into inside the penthouse in, in the halls. We'll get to his room now. Chuck. Stab, stab, stab. Guy, I've only only used him at the beginning, didn't I? I don't think he's going to last very long. I hope the doors flew open, a bit windy. Four. Oh, I need that chicken. Oh, I've got full health now. Oh, I picked it up. I picked it up. Down, that's it. Now up. And that's a tactic to beat these guys. And then you. Oh, no, chucking that. Chandler. 
get me. And again. I, I, thought, I thought he was gone then, but no. That's us, got him. One bow. I feel I'm nearly there. Because you're getting a lot of enemies on the screen. But, Come on, Simons. You don't want to be here, do you? Let's go home. Put some peas on that eye. Oh, three stabbies. Bollywood. Elgado. And Bollywood. Or is it Hollywood? Should have jumped. Like I say, we're in our case that you'll probably have a, a little bit more reaction. That's why I wanna I think wanna wanna try this, have a proper arcade session. Let's go with these two. Roxy and uh, poison. Oh no, easy brothers as well, hoping to join in. Yeah, that authentic feel, I'll uh, get one of my arcade sticks and uh, have a proper arcade arcade session. Oh, why did I think about a star? I could jump on top of that. Just protect me from the fire. Come on, we're nearly there. Come on. Oh, I've seen him coming. I've seen him coming too slow. He dodged the fire. Wow. I didn't dodge his stabby though, did I? Come on, we're nearly there. I've just got to get rid of these guys. No, don't want poison that side. Or is it Roxa? Poison. Go okay, that way. I've oh, got him that side. Is that it? We're done. It's got to be. There's this carpet, look. Oh, just some chandeliers. I love that. Full elf. Another one. Looks like it's preparing me, isn't it, for the uh, the final. Do oh, wait, we're here. I thought they were going to be a room, but they're not. He just turns up in his chair, man. He sits. Oh, look at that. Let's get him out of his chair. He didn't need a chair, look. Perfectly... He's not disabled. He's quite perfectly able-bodied, look. Getting around all right, isn't he? On his feet. Jumping up and down, look. Right, for that, you're going to get smacked. Benefit for all, isn't it? Not an easy. 
killed the Baron and uh, Major Criminal is also a benefit for a horde with his uh, claiming disability benefit. He's quite able bodied. Bring him to justice. Get out that window. Take some fresh air. Yeah. That's it. Round six clear. And I think that is complete. Final fight. Arcade. Triumph. There's another. Oh, father. I was so scared. I'm so glad to see they didn't uh, hurt you. I'm so sorry, Jessica. I thought I'd lost you. Michael lost your mother. I'll never let anything bad happen to you again. Wonder what happened to her mother? Not really a no before story, is there? Did she run off with another man? I don't know. Didn't say, does it? Did she die? Could be anything. But whatever happened, he lost her. screen the titles we'll go walk all the way back from, to the beginning probably gonna get an ice cream or something like that it's not a nice day yeah so yeah it's final fight hope you enjoyed it um don't know what i'm gonna play next i'm gonna go go through my uh collection have a look see what i can play uh, if i've not got it i'll uh see if i can emulate it um i've got a pretty decent pc so I'm sure there's a game if I can't get it or or if I have got it I just haven't got the console see I've got uh, I've got this on there but I haven't I, I haven't even got Super Famicom to play it but uh, where are you going how can you just walk away now I want to stay here with you Jessica but I can't not while evil still stalks the streets oh Cody Game over. That's it. I right, just put my uh, initial in. Bam. Short for the channel. And there we go. So yeah, if you enjoyed this one, leave some comments. We'll see if you have anything you like to see uh, on the next one. Blast from a past. That is. Um, yeah, I really enjoy this game. I'm going to give it another go. But I'm going to try it with an arcade stick next for that authentic feel. But yeah, I really. Uh, enjoyed playing through this again brought back some good memories but yeah so if you liked it leave us a like if not leave us a you know subscription as well we do appreciate that so yeah to, uh, hopefully see you uh, next time <laughs>